I'm Alice Rawsthorne and I write about design. I'm mainly interested in design as a social, political and environmental tool, but I also love it personally and so I'm really into fashion. My choice of best in show is this look from A Plan Application. It's a new label that was launched a season ago by the German artist Anna Blessman. And she's interested not in fashion, but in clothes, clothes that have enduring qualities and that people will want to buy, wear, and then build on the looks season after season. I loved the first collection of A Plan Application. So it's a fantastic combination of a very sleek, chic, sporty look, which is obvious from these pieces, but also also amazing materials, beautiful finishing, very nuanced color choices, and lots of subtlety in every aspect of the construction of the garments. Um, so this is from the second season, and I love it because it's very typical of Anna's personal look. All of A-Plan application is based on the vintage clothes that she's customized over the years and how she wants to dress herself. And so this strikes me as very much straight from a Rainer Werner Fassbinder movie set in the 1970s or one of Volker Schlerndorf's road movies in the early 80s. Um, it's sporty, it's casual, it's easy to wear, it's very now. I love the jaunty cap, which is perfectly proportioned. Very difficult, particularly if you're a woman, to get a cap that's really right. Um, Anna is brilliant at the subtlety of detailing, like the width of the shoulders, which always give a little emphasis, so you don't look all sort of hunched and slouchy, but are never overly exaggerated. The sleeves are always very slender. They fit perfectly. And the buttons, which look like any other sort of jeans jacket button from a distance, but when you look at them closely, the finish is really perfect. There's a wonderful glossy texture to them, and I think that's one of the little details that makes a plan application so special. Another reason why I love this outfit is I think that when people look back on this period in decades to come, they'll realize that typologically we're having a schismic shift in the way we dress. And by this, I don't mean the kind of fashion looks that you'd see in Paris, Milan, or London Fashion Week, but very much the clothes generically that people buy. So I'd say there are parallels with, say, the 20s, when suddenly women started wearing very loose fluid looks rather than the starchy, stiff, corseted garments they'd worn in the late 19th century or in the 50s and 60s when jeans, which hitherto really had just been workwear, increasingly became generic clothing. Obviously, the defining theme of clothing in recent years, if not recent decades, has been sportswear. And one of the things I love about recent collections is that it's interpreting sportswear and all the functional and sensual advantages that it has being soft, cozy, comfortable, very versatile, flexible, fluid, and easy to move in, and also very durable. Um, but it's interpreting it in a much sleeker, luxier way. So I think this sort of plain white jeans combo with the jaunty cap encapsulates that perfectly.